your goal is to define your own life and build your own dream and define your own destiny. And that's why I'm here, because my, I, I believe that my goal is to help people like you, because someone has helped me to be where I am today. My goal is to help people like you define who you are and help you to monetize it. That's the key, though. It's all well and good you know your destiny. If you don't know how to monetize your destiny, you'll still be broke. Because a lot of people don't know how to sell. They don't like sales. I'm sorry, but Apple's determined to win. To win. Whatever he does, he's determined to win. There's a determination there to win. So even if you believe, and I don't believe that for you, but even if, how do you think I learned to become a property investor? <laughs> Quite right. So I actually went into a shop, saw this magazine there about property investing. I didn't realize it was for sale. And I picked it up and I took it home. <laughs> Three days later, and he said, Do you know that book was for sale? I said, They probably won't remember me by now. I studied that book to a T and became a property investor. I bought one, then another, then four, then two, and another, then another. Can you teach yourself anything? Mm -hmm. So, okay, I want to ask you guys a question now. I want you to think, I really want you to think. What is the one thing that you would want to do that is in line with your destiny? I want you to write it down, one thing. One thing that is your destiny, one thing. What you really want to do, but you're doing it for someone else, and you, all of us, Christian, Muslim, Jew, okay? It happens to all of us. What is the one thing? It might be a book, and that book may be your bestseller, and that book may be your key to your success, and that book may cause you to travel around the world and change people's lives, that one book. What is it? What is it you're doing right now that you know, or what is it that's in your heart that if you were to die in a year's time, you can say, yes, I've done I've done what I have called, I was called to do. Because I believe, if not everybody in here, is not fully living out their destiny. Because your, the Bible says your gifts make room. It means it will cause you to be free. It will cause you to be free financially. It will cause you to be free. It will cause you to have money. It will cause you to have investments. It will cause you to be in a place where you can be a blessing. It can cause you to be in that place. Most of us are in that place. We want to give, but we're going to live. My mentor says to me, if you want to help the poor, get rich. Okay? So, whatever you're doing right now that's in line with someone else's destiny, teach yourself how to do it yourself. Can you study enough to do it? Can you study one day a week? Can you study three, three four days a month? Can you take up one hour a day and study and, and learn how to do that thing instead of doing it for someone else? Property, Keith, you can do that. Because that's your passion, I know it. I'm doing it. <laughs> we talk about it all the time. What else? What else, guys? What else? What are you doing? What are you doing, Wilhelmina? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? Because, guys, I promise you, if you don't teach yourself to do it, nobody will. And you will be sad and unfulfilled all your life. You would live wondering, what if? What if? I'm going to show you after the break how to go about from where you are now to defining your destiny and to realizing your destiny and to start walking in your, in your destiny as well.